What's up, y'all? So uh, me and Naima finally talked face to face. If y'all don't know what happened, I might see if I can find a video or they might put the videos in here. But Ray beat somebody up and listen, it was a lot. So I just want to get into this video. I don't even want to wait. Hurry up. Let's go. Let's get it. <laughs> What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying? And if you are new, welcome to the league. I already said the title. Let's get it. What's up, Wavy Gang? It's your girl, Ray, and we back with another banger on the channel. Gang, so let's see. Y'all say we coming with that heat. What I always say, we coming with that sauce, that drip. Hey, y'all see, I got a special guest with me. Go ahead and introduce yourself. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Naima. And y'all, today by the caption, y'all already know we doing my 400K special. So listen. Y'all know YouTubers, y'all get to see like a little hints of our private life sometimes and y'all don't never really get to see like what really, really be going on behind the scenes all the time. So as y'all can see, I got my girl Naima in the video and y'all know what happened between me and Naima. What was that? When was that? Like two years ago? It was a minute ago. Two years ago. Three? Three? One? <laughs> okay. Nigga, was a when ago. was it? It was like a year and a half. That it. No, nah, we going on like two years, bro. No, Bro. There's no way. There's <laughs> no way. Anyways, y'all. So y'all see what happened between me and Naeem. I'm pretty sure y'all seen a lot of stuff going on social media. And basically, y'all, we just wanted to do this video for y'all and really sit down in front of the camera to really, like, hash out what happened. We got questions for each other. We made up. I got seven questions. She got seven questions. And we just made up questions to basically ask each other, like, just questions about the situation since we never really, we never really sat down and talked about it, y'all. Like, we never, you know, like, we never, and I just don't want y'all to see us pop up. Y'all know how, like, some YouTubers just pop up on camera cool after, like, some social media shit that went on and it just make it look fake. But what yeah. happened between us was very 100% real. So, like, I feel like y'all should get the real sit down and basically just, you know, hear about down. the situation and just see us hash this out I on camera. So if you're ready for this video, make sure you give this video a thumbs up right now. If you're new to this channel, welcome to the Wavy Gang, the latest gang on YouTube right now. And let's get into the video. All right, y'all. So like I said, we got seven questions for each other. And now I want me to kick it off because... You know, this is my channel, so she just feel like I should start it off. But I don't know what she finna ask me, but y'all know I'm finna... Y'all, you know I'm, I'm nervous. Saying? Why you nervous? Because I don't know but what you got. Like, okay. it, it ain't nothing. It ain't nothing. Like, Let's it's a go. real last question. You know what I'm saying? Get like, this is it. a real last conversation. So, all right. So, my first question is... And y'all see we using the phone, so we gonna have to be doing flip, you know? <laughs> um, My first question is... Do you believe I had any ingenuine intentions towards you since we met? Like, any ingenuine, like... Ingenuine is a word, y'all? Yeah? I don't know, like... No, she made that up. that's why I could say, like, when we fell out, like, it low-key... Here is a great hack on how... I ain't gonna lie. Naima's so damn messy. I don't know if you... So clearly some of y'all... I mean, because... Y'all saying y'all don't know uh, who... Y'all got to know, Ray. But uh, y'all may not know who Naima is, but <sighs> basically, Ray went to do a collab with Naima, and a whole bunch of shit happened where uh, they did a video or whatever, and Naima was pranking Ray, but they were supposed to be doing it together, and basically, Naima was talking to some girl, and the girl got upset because she believed what was going on. She didn't think it was a prank. She thought... Ray and Naima was messing around and Ray beat her ass. That's basically it. Ray beat her ass and then there was a whole bunch of shit happening after that. The genuineness, you feel me? So it wasn't like, okay, our whole friendship was like genuineness. So like when we fell out, like the way that we fell out, I feel like it could have been 
done differently. Do you think you was being emotional because you a Pisces? You just said this. Before. She just what said this does before Pisces video. have to do but with I'm anything? Saying, like, you saying it like it really now. hurt your feelings? You know, like some people could say like, "Oh, that really hurt me." You get what I'm saying? But like that, did that really hurt you? Like, damn, me and Ray fell out. Like. Yeah, because even after we fell out and I seen, like, I still followed you on Twitter. We still followed each other on Twitter. Yeah, we never followed each other. I don't know why y'all. Like, we just never followed each other. And, like, yeah, I used definitely to see, like, hands, certain stuff sure. that you post and you feel me? Like, I used to always check up on you. So it was just, like, when I had seen that, I was like, I already know half the stuff that you be going through. That's why I reached out to you. I was like, fuck everything we went through. Okay, okay. What's wrong with you? Like, you good? Fuck All right. Me. I believe you. I believe you. All right. Now, my question is... When we fell out, how did that truly make you feel? I feel like that shit was a slap in the face, y'all. I ain't even gonna lie. Like, when me and I fell out, it threw me in for a loop because it's like, now was the first, like, influencer that, like, I reached out to really trying to collab. Because first, like, China reached out to me. Y'all know, like, my first big collab was China. Then when you had posted me, like, the first time ever... I felt like, damn, like, I'm like, damn, I really want to collab with Hansel Cool shit. And I don't, I'm really not, like, I come off as cool, but I'm really not a people's person. Now, you know that. So, like, when that shit happened, I'm just like, damn, like, is this really how it's going to be when I, like, run into influences? shit? But then again, I knew, like, just the surroundings and shit that you... Like, just, just to be in the same room, first of all, if I go out of town and you supposed to be looking out for me or whatever... And you got me in a room full of people that I don't know. You know, that was number one for me. But that's that young shit, too, because, you know, they young. Young people just do young people shit. I've been in a room with a bunch of motherfuckers I didn't know. And the shit went left. Like, it's just so not safe to be around a whole bunch of people you don't know. But this is still their life. You know what I'm saying? This is what they're going to do. But you, you can't be around messy people. It's almost just, it's just like, like birds of a feather flock together. So if the main one is messy, then the rest of them got to be, you know what I'm saying? But Naima could be so fucking lit. She just got a, uh, an attachment to a certain type of mess that is just, it just hit different. Oh, child of greatest. Okay. That's what I thought. Yeah. That, that, the type of mess she be in, it just, it'd be too much. It, it's like not safe. You know what I'm saying? She was around. Like I knew that played a part in a lot of shit that happened. So like I took that in consideration, y'all, but I just felt hella shitty. Cause I'm just like, damn, like I really thought we was better than that. Like, I don't know. Like that was just my thought process with that. Shit. I just was like, damn, I really thought we was better than that. So it was kind of just like, I had to brush that shit out, but I didn't even want to go through no shit like that again with somebody. Like, somebody yeah. that I truly fuck with, I'm like, damn, I don't even want to go through this again. So, like, I just didn't want to even reach out to no more influences after that. Like, I didn't. But you did. I was dead ass. Like, I was though. cool on that shit, y'all. Like, no cap. But y'all know how I am, Wavy Gang. Y'all know how I am. All right, next question. When you watched the video, that's if she watched the video, if you watched any pieces of the video, did you at least see where I was coming from in any parts of the video? Yeah, like I watched, I literally sat there, when you dropped the video, I sat there and I watched the whole thing. And one thing that you didn't do, like you was explaining your side, but you didn't bash me like most people would have did. So I was listening to it and I'm like, what? <laughs> really? Like, what? Like, why did you say, like, what? <laughs> really, though? You expect me to get on that motherfucker, like... I mean, you made a YouTube video, so I'm thinking you're going to get up there, oh, she did, she died, da, da, da. But you literally sat there and expressed your feelings without bashing me. Nobody has ever done that. Anybody I ever fell out with, they just go to social media. She messed with people that, uh, you know, fuck her over, I believe, because she's a nice person and she sees genuine in everybody. I feel like. I feel like... Ray is a really nice person and um, that kindness be taken for weakness. And, and we seen that kindness be taken for weakness because she beat that girl up. Like, she really be her. <laughs> I was like, oh, damn. I, that was my first time seeing Ray, to be honest with you. Uh, that was my first time being introduced to her. So I'm just like, damn. When she's speaking, this shit is nice. You know what I'm saying? Her, how she... How she talking, you know, the things she do or whatever. Her, she just a nice person, but people like to take advantage of nice people and you get your ass beat. And hey, bash me. Yeah. And I that girl, it. the I, girl, I, whoever she was, I mean, no disrespect to you. It's just, well, I mean, you took an L. I mean, let's just say that. But um, it's just like, it was just like, it was so messy. If I could find a video, I'd 
show y'all. See, I ain't the type though, y'all. Like, I just feel like if I'm gonna say something, I'm gonna try to get my point across. But I want you to understand where I'm coming from. And I don't feel like coming off like negative about the shit or like just attacking it with like strong emotions. I feel like I wouldn't have got my point across in that video. The video was too long at that. So like. <laughs> <laughs> that bitch will make a long I video. Like I would have really got So that brings me to my next question. Okay. Right. What made you make a video about someone you cared about at one point trying to end me? That's the thing, though. I didn't do that video intentionally trying to end you. What pissed me off is when you said you was going to slap me. That <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah, I'm dead ass, though. Like, that <laughs> sent another nerve through my body because I hate shit like that. Like, if we would have fought behind camera, okay, cool. Say what you got to say. Say you're going to slap me, beat me, whatever you're going to do. But don't say no shit like that on camera and we supposed to be cool. Like, that made me feel like you was trying to embarrass me in a sense. And it's it's the embarrass for me. Y'all keep saying y'all y'all ain't seen the video, child. Let me find the damn video. I'm going to put Naima just to see if that video come up. Oh, this it. Another banger on the channel. Get into it. And... No. Get out. Oh, here it is. As soon as I fucking left, I was still in the same... So what happened is Naima was supposed to go along with the prank or something whatever naima did it pissed the girl off that she was talking to naima said that her and ray had did something which was not true and which was i'm assuming wasn't supposed to be a part of the prank because she flipped what you talking about damn i'm right on the spot together everything get out that was the point. The camera was in the room. Or her girlfriend had just pranked her and then Naima got mad, so she made up a lie about Ray. Since I fucking left, I was still in the same room. What you talking about? Bro, the was wrong. They was texting me the whole time. I was in the hotel last night. I fucked Ray. Now what? So this. So she says. When I went to the hotel room last night, I fucked Ray, which was an absolute lie. But this is why pranks are fake, y'all. And I always have to explain this because people be like, damn, why the fuck they faking pranks? Which I don't understand is a big, why that's a big deal. When you can go watch a whole movie and understand that characters are created and that they get paid millions of dollars to do this shit. Okay. YouTubers are also getting paid thousands of dollars to do pranks and they are fake for this reason. Now what? Ray is now looking what? at Naima like, what? Like, but she's shocked. She can't, she not even gonna say nothing cause she trying to figure out what the energy about to be on. Now what? what? So, now what? this nigga now got mad now what? and Ray thinks she playing. Now, Ray traveled over to where Naima was just to do, you know, videos and shit. So she ain't even at her home. Naima is still going along with the prank, knowing that that girl don't think she playing. So now Ray got a fight. And Ray thinking that girl bullshit. Ray thinking she bullshit. That's why she's smiling. Now, mind you, it's a whole fucking pit bull in here. This, I would have lost my fucking mind. But... Look at, okay, hold on. Ray almost kicked that girl face off her, her body. Did you see, do you see her foot and her face? The whole, her whole foot almost broke the girl whole neck. Do you hear what I'm saying? She kicked her ass in the face. Woo. And then the next one. Woo. She kicked her, her head into the wall. Who? And, and lost her fucking mind. And I hate when people, okay, get your ass the fuck off me. And still wanted her. She's scared at this point. This girl's scared at this point. Ray wanted all the smoke. Y'all 
Ray wanted all the smoke. So Ray is completely out of character at this point. She didn't even know she was about to be fighting the girl. She had no fucking idea. She, she like, what? What? Like, I'm not even trying to fight. I, I thought this was a prank. Why are you trying to fight me? And I'm not at home. You know what I'm saying? She went from smiling to dead ass serious. Took her head off with that one. Head ended up in the damn wall. Then she ran the fuck up out of there. Oh, she kicked somebody else. She didn't even kick that girl. I didn't even notice that. She kicked the other girl. She didn't even mean to do that, but what if what if the other girl jumped in? You get what I'm saying? She done kicked a whole nother girl. So what if everybody in the house fucking jumped Ray because she done kicked this girl? This nigga ran and she running. She had no idea. She still wanted her ass. Let's go. Talking about word to my son, I was just playing with you. You see, Naima, Naima is cool with it. Talking about it's a prank, you dumbass. No, 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 no. This is not a prank. You get what I'm saying? This is not a prank. This is why pranks are not real. You know what I'm saying? Don't ever really, like, like when, when it comes to, I'm going to Houston on the 24th slash 25th or whatever. I'm going to have security and everything armed because I don't, I don't, I don't like to play. You know what I'm saying? I don't like to play. So if we're going to do videos, bet. But all this shit right here, but see, I would never be in a room full of fucking 20 year olds either. And, and I'm talking about at a house in a room. I, this, this is too many fucking people. I, how am I going to get out? This hell no. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I'm just saying, you know, young shit. But this is what happened. You know, Ray done had to beat somebody up. It's like, nah, bro, like, I don't even rock like that because I wouldn't even thought, like, okay, since we fell out, I'm finna put my hands on her off rip. That's not, we didn't even have a conversation about what happened. I wasn't even that angry. It was more so, like, disappointment. So I wasn't finna sit here and just be like, ah, oh, I'm finna beat her ass or that though when i seen naeem alive with her saying that bro y'all that shit just was like all right cool that's how you want to play it this what i'm finna do i'm finna tell you why i think you wrong and i'm finna make this video and leave it at that i'm not finna sit here and try to you know i'm finna whoop naeem i wasn't doing none of that shit y'all like i don't know that just ain't me that ain't me baby, <laughs> <laughs> that ain't me, baby. all right next question when did you come to realization that I wanted what's best for you? Like, when did you realize, like, damn, maybe Ray did want what's best for me, like... You've always wanted what's best for me. Like, any time I've, I've ever, see, like, not fell off with that girl? element, you'd be like, nah, you gotta do this. You gotta get on your shit. That's some hell of forgiveness. Like, but I, it's just like, when on. that situation happened, when... I gotta cut my mic up, because, well, hell, I think it's up. It is. Oh, okay. Um, I'm trying to find if Naima's still with that girl. This right here, some hella forgiveness. Hella, hella, hella forgiveness right here. You know what I'm saying? Bro, you this just lets me know Ray got a good heart. Uh, Naima ain't did a video in a year. Damn. No, Naima talking to a guy. Oh, okay. Okay. Right, that's what she needs. Somebody to calm her the fuck down. <laughs> okay. When did you come to realization like, damn, like oh, she moved to North Carolina, so she not in uh, Atlanta anymore. Okay, good, 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 good. This really good. was my friend, like, cause I know not right yeah. after. Even when you watch the video, you could have just been like, damn, this really was my friend. But like, I want to know, like, as far as past like days or months or whatever, when did you just be like, damn, like. That was really my friend. To be honest, 
after I watched the video and I dad ass sat there and like heard you out, I'm like, damn, like. I really did this girl. Like so my that. video really touched your heart. That's it did. Even though know, I'm a Pisces, I'm very emotional. So it's like any little thing, I'm just be like, damn, that's how she really felt. So I'm glad you heard me out. All right, that's cool. That's cool. I was I was thinking it wasn't after the video, but that's good to know. That means my I was video. I wasn't gonna be the one to say we were beefing at the time. <laughs> so I wasn't gonna tell you that. But yeah. Oh, so now she's telling me that, y'all. All right, let's get it. Well, as long as she as long as she ain't in Atlanta no more. You know, when you get caught up in, in the in the bullshit, I you know, I've had situations where I was young and, you know, was in some dangerous situations. So I don't, I'm never the one to want to act like that was never me. But, you know, that's probably why they'll call me a grandma on here because, uh, I've you know, it's kind of like I've been there, done that type shit. And I don't, uh-uh. that's not where I want to go anymore. So I know where not to go. Like, oh, hell no. Nah. I, I ain't going to do that. I'm I'm straight. Yes, I'm ready. I'm ready. Type shit. So why did you lie at the end and said you had me pinned up on the wall? Girl, who lied? You had me. We was fighting. You had me. Well, okay, we was fighting. You had me pinned up on the wall. Yes, bro. You finna sit here and lie, Naima. Oh my, bro. You really finna sit here and lie on everything I love when we was. You don't remember when we was fighting, bro. <laughs> we was play fighting, but you didn't have me. Don't bro, make it I seem like so I didn't hear you up on the wall. Don't make it seem like. like oh, it I can't wait till this truth I drink, y'all. I swear to God, cause this girl, <laughs> no, no. But but don't sit there and make it seem like it was on some like sexual like oh I had you pinned up against no we was play fighting but it wasn't even so, on no so, terms like oh, that oh that's one of my questions of the truth I drink y'all remember what she just said right <laughs> remember what she just said wait till the truth I drink okay I can't wait just remember that okay no I, I, didn't fly, I know <laughs> just wait till the truth I wait, drink wait, all right wait. Nick I know I'm not a grandma but some of them they have said in reference to people being on YouTube at 30. Like 30 years on YouTube, like, huh? Like, what? I'm confused. <laughs> what does that matter? They think 24 and 20, they think 27 year olds are old. Y'all gotta remember these, they 20, 19, 20, 21, they young. Young as hell. So they out here thinking 27 year olds is old and shit. And I'm over here, I'm 32 and blessed and beautiful. I'm beautiful. You know what I'm saying? Beautiful. And over here thinking, they got to think I'm a grandma because I'm 32. I mean, hell, they calling CJ so cool. Grandpa, we the same age. <laughs> I don't act like he, he acts 32. You know, that nigga acts 32. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just saying. I'm one of them niggas be like, you know, back in my day, you know what I'm saying? Next question. <laughs> when I dropped that video, did you think like in any part of the video that I was trying to like talk down on you or like just make you look bad? No, but I in, said any like when I video. watched the video, literally Facts. me and my ex sat there and watched the video and I was like. Yeah, Ty reaching 30 and Ty is 23 years old. Shy, she is fucking three years older than you. I just thought about that because I am I was re referencing that to Ty and Ty is a baby. I am confused. So girl, somebody that's 23 and I'm over here 32. I'm almost 10 years older than her. You know what I'm saying? Nah. <laughs> Child. She uplifted me in this video. We 30 and up on this bitch doing a blood clot thing. You dig what I'm saying? In a more, in a more calm way. You know what I'm saying? These damn 20 year olds is on YouTube showing they ass. Now I was 20 year, years old showing my ass, but I wasn't on the internet. But I should have been because I would be rich now. You get what I'm saying? Yo. Shit. <laughs> I'm like, she's not even talking down to me. Like, she's really uplifting me in this video. Like, she's saying what she got to say and at the same time uplifting me. And I was just like, huh? <laughs> this is how you know she used the toxic shit, y'all. Like, that's just toxic. Literally. You don't think no parts. You just she like, toxic damn. toxic as hell. For sure. No. You don't remember that far back? Me either, really. No, I don't. Me either. I remember bits and pieces of it, but I know you did not talk down to me at all Which in the video. It was just 20. I was just 20 something two years ago. Well, three years ago. You know what I'm saying? But they about to be 30 in 10 years. If YouTube making your money, 
What you telling me? You getting off YouTube when you turn 30? Uh, uh, we know that's a lie. Unless you find another app, which I'm sure y'all will. But you're going to be on apps for the rest of your life. So when you turn 30, they're going to be saying the same shit. I know I'm 30, but they're going to be saying the same shit. And when I'm 40, I'm still going to be doing my thing. I'm really going to be in my prime at 40, bitch. Yo. I did. Oh. You That's what really made me want to reach out to you more. And then you I see like the little sad too. stuff that you was posting. I was just like, oh, she really don't got no friends. <laughs> I don't know who she talked to. She used to come to me a bit about everything. So I was just like, put my pride to the side. Okay, okay, okay. Do you wish things would have went differently? I feel like, yes. Anybody would have wished any, like something like that would have went differently. Like you argue with somebody you care about. I feel like I don't go and just... Baby. I'm starting my liquor tomorrow. Can you give me a little liquor? <laughs> you start your liquor I'm starting it. I ain't gonna I ain't gonna drink no liquor tomorrow. You know what? I'm gonna take it down to once a week. Can you give me some? When I was lost sixty pounds, we was drinking black label. Yes, we were. Hmm, and that's on period. I just can't drink no IPAs in this motherfucker. No, you can't. Been to anybody, y'all. So like, I don't know. Like, I just felt like. When that situation happened, I first of all, y'all, as much as y'all see me in this mischief with these little women, <laughs> I really hate like that. Ass. Mischief with these little women, okay? Yes, I really hate confrontation, like drama like that, though, like how we had. I just feel like, yeah, I wish it went differently because I was hella soup to like come kick it with you, bro. Like I was hella just juiced to like just, I don't know. Have yeah. fun with you, bro, and I told you that. Like, I just felt like, damn, like, why did it have to go like this? Like, honestly, out of all the people that I linked up with, but, like, uh, at its influences, me and I had a bond, like, an actual bond before we was finna link up. So, like, that's why I was hella more comfortable with linking up with her, and that's why that shit threw me off when it happened, because I'm just like, damn, like, yeah, nigga, we was on. cool, like, FaceTiming, all type of shit, y'all. So it just was like... Yeah, I wish it would have went differently because I felt like that would have gave me a better aspect on how I would interact with other influencers. But now I just feel like, damn, bro, being in this like influencer world on this YouTube, shit, you really got to pick and choose who you really you want do. To like, you do, thank you. You, know you do. All money ain't good money in this industry. You, mm -mm -mm. I got a lot of questions before we even do a video, bitch. What's going on? You want to do a video? Uh, uh. Let's go out to eat first. Let's go out to eat first and. We about to drink. Let's get lit. I want to see how you act when we lit. Uh-uh. Mm-mm. Uh-uh. Especially, y'all, the ones with money. I've been around a lot of people with money, okay? Not everybody's the same. You got some people that act like they ain't got $1, i.e. Zo. <laughs> that nigga Zoe, like, you would never know he's rich. You would never, ever know he's rich. Hell, I don't think he know he rich, Okay. He is a, a, a chill, very, very, very chill person with some money. It's like he not even rich for real, but he rich as hell. Do you think you was wrong about anything you did in a situation that we had? Yeah, okay. Now we can really talk about it. Okay, so when y'all had started fighting, it was so many people around. That's why I didn't break it. It was mad niggas around. So it's like, they all trying to break up the fight. I didn't, first of all, I didn't even know I was going to fight. Y'all broke my window and everything. So it was like, it was a lot of people around. So I'm thinking, oh, they're going to break it up. Uh, they just let y'all fight. And I feel like it more so had a lot to do with the people that I had around too. Because they liked seeing stuff like that. Mm -hmm. You, you could tell. And yeah, that was on my end. And you too. Y'all shouldn't have fought. But I mean, it happened and it is what it is. Then another thing, me going live. Me going live set it off. If I would have never went live... It would have never... Hit social media. Yeah. It would have never been as deep as it was. But I So what lie. made you go live? Like, you, were, <laughs> you really thought I was trying Messy. to post that video out of spite, though? Like, just take the clips and just be like, all right, I'm finna just post this video because of what happened. I don't, girl, I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with me. Like, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> she's a Pisces and she's messy. Oh. I don't know. This but, yeah, live cool. really took a big part in this See, situation. I like that she can own up to her. You know Me wrong, too, though, though y'all, because some people say... I will say that. At least she owned up to it. At least they making up, because, you know, life too short. I mean, you ain't got to be friends. I am an advocate for that. Baby, I could love you from a distance. However, if they decide to make up and, you know, uh, everything cool, then that's cool. Act like they didn't do shit wrong and I don't like that, but it's like... 
Like I said, I feel like we outgrown this situation. So at the end of the day, it's like it ain't no reason to sit in this camera and just cap to y'all or to each other. You know what I'm saying? What triggered you about me through this whole situation? Your girlfriend. Who? I felt like no bullshit. Not trying to speak on her. I felt like the shit your girl let you do. Like, don't get me wrong. You got your friends too. But how I am, the shit she was letting you do, it's like... I just seen it as, why let your girl do this? Like, at the end of the day, your girl is going to be, she going to feel that, all right, this is my diary. Like, this is one of my best. Really, yo, like, the person you date, I know y'all know where I'm coming from. The person you date, you really feel like, this is my best friend. This is my right hand. So, like, I felt like in that situation, the shit that she was letting you do, I didn't like that. I didn't fuck with that. And I could tell you really messed with her. And it's like, okay, you got your friends. But like you said, your friends, like, messy shit. But one thing I peeped about Kizzy, I'm not going to lie, she laid back. She was chill. So I felt like if you a chill, laid back ass person, don't let your girl go and do shit like this. Don't get me wrong. She not your parent. She not your nothing. But even when I was there and you was on live arguing with that girl and she was sitting there, nah, that pissed me off so fucking bad because I'm like, this is your girl. Like, don't let her do shit like this. Like, you should have spoke up like, hey, shorty, like, chill, man, fuck them, like, you just too, you was too reserved. She was too reserved. And I don't got nothing against kids, you know what I'm saying? The shit happened. It is what it is. That shit happened a year ago. But I just felt like you didn't have nobody to really, it was her and really her friends too. But it's like, I, I go towards Kizzy because I could tell her and our bond was way stronger, I should say, than you and your friend. It just seemed like y'all really was best friends for real, in my eyes. It just seemed like your kids was really best friends. So I was just kind of like, then when all that shit happened, that shit really rubbed me the wrong way. Because I could tell even when I was around her, like, she had, like, a... Secret animosity. Yeah, like, and it was like, I was just already feeling some type of way, so... And, just, and that be that little stud shit, you know what I'm saying? You get around certain people. I'm, I'm the type, especially now, I get around certain people... And I'm not feeling your vibe, baby. I'm out. Like, I'm out. Because I can't. Some shit happened with me. And um, I basically, you know, had to take somebody home uh, that was at a distance. And my daddy made a reference to you sitting with the person that could kill you in your back seat. Ever since he said that, nah, I'm good. Because he right. You know, it's some grimy, 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 disgusting, uh, envious, uh, evil people out here that are literally, they want to hurt you. You know what I'm saying? And you don't know that. And with being so nice and, and all that shit, and you'll find yourself in a fucked up situation. She she was like that because she knew sort of that me and you at first had a little yeah, KJ. whatever it was going on. Yeah, yeah, but it's like, bro, I asked you that though. You should have just spoke up. That it ain't it ain't even about that right now. But that that shit really was pissing me off though, because I'm like, you could tell Naima don't really got a lot of people in her corner. So it's like, as your girl, as like you feel me, you need to talk to her. Like, don't nah. Yes. Nah, my dad be speaking girl. that shit. And you, and your friends. But <laughs> my mainly her, because she shit. just really was sitting there like... And he's 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 like brutally honest. You know what I'm saying? To the point you be like, ouch. You know, I'm still your daughter. I don't give a fuck, nigga. <laughs> no, he don't say that. But it's like, you know, I know you are, but shit. You know, you, you got to be trained for this real world out here, because this shit ain't no hoe. You know what I'm saying? And there's some dangerous people out here and although you could be more dangerous okay um just don't 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 let nobody play with you people really show you who you who they are in the first hey how you doing my name is you you can know how a person is in that moment swear to y'all what's going on this i know exactly how you are I, I, my body, like, I don't know, y'all, the shit is weird, but my body will literally be like, nah, nope. And now I listen, because every time my body did that, I get a, a anxious feeling, almost a feeling like I'm about to fight. That's the feeling I, I get, you know what I'm saying? And it's like, nah, you got to go. You got to go. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to intuition. <laughs> this 
normal bro no bro i never let my girl do that I'm and sorry. that's one thing about ray like any little thing she ever see me and she texted me stop doing that why are you doing that because it's just <laughs> like bro i just know how that shit go so i just didn't like that shit, y'all no cap what made you i feel like you answered this in a sense but what made you apologize and what made you apologize at the time you did because Man, you came no months more. later like months later so <laughs> like what Where's my phone? Because at the end of the day, like, I don't really admit like when I'm wrong. But in a sense, I knew I played a huge part in this situation leading to where it led to. And then, like, I told you, like I said, we followed each other on Twitter. And I used to see these sad-ass posts you was posting. And I'm just like, oh, my no, gosh. This girl don't got nobody to talk to. <laughs> like, And it was just like, I put my pride to the side. And it was the genuineness Lush. coming out of me. Like, you know what? everything we've been through are you good yeah. like that wasn't even me just you show she sent me a paragraph y'all <laughs> uh. she sent me a book i'm just like this girl but it's like i would rather her did that than to just act like ain't nothing ever happened between us like like that would have been weird if i would have just came back around like and i don't know why we were still following each other on twitter because we was because i was seeing her tweets too i just didn't <laughs> unfollow her i feel like i did enough yeah. i followed her on instagram so it was just like yeah. I don't know. I went to her Twitter. I said, oh, she still follows me. There's no reason for me to follow her. And then I just... And we just... Even, I even retweeted some of your stuff. <laughs> it was just... I don't know, man. I'm not the type to just be mad for hell alone. That's just not my personality. I just don't be mad for hell alone. I'm really not like that. Like, Girl. Taurus, I feel like we get over stuff just mad quick. 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 Do you feel like you and Kizzy Loki had secret animosity? Yeah, we did, but that's the thing. She had animosity with me. I never really had animosity towards her because I wasn't getting at you like that. I never do no shit like that. Like, if I see you fucking with your gal, you know, I know me and I did whatever, whatever before then, but I'm in front of you oh, and your that's girl. What's up, like, Ryan. that's disrespectful. I want all y'all to take hate, a picture. Honestly, Everybody, hey, I would beat hey. somebody ass if they came. Everybody that got a shirt, take a picture. Came around my girl trying to, like, be on them or anything. But the thing is, I was chilling the whole time. So you. As for her, I feel like she should have been a grown woman and came to me and be like, hey, bro, like, I'm just not comfortable with you being around my girl. Honestly, y'all, I would have bounced because it's like yeah. I understand at the end of the day, it ain't like I can say disrespect you and be like, oh, it's a collab. Because, like, it just, it wasn't about the money with me. It was really about me just kicking when I get to know her. Like, from day one, like, it was really just me kicking with you and get to know you. So it's like, to be around me and to make secret animosity to me, that's weird because I felt like, you literally could. I literally asked her. I said, dude, like, you feel some type of way. She, oh, no, nah, bro, like, it's good. But when y'all watch that video, they probably going to go back from this video. A lot of people going to go back and watch them videos. Y'all, let's see how she was acting in that video. Like I said, this ain't to speak down on kids or nothing. Like, you know, I don't know her like that. But I just don't roll like that. So she got her own little shit going on. <laughs> nothing no. Nick, I feel like you got that dry sense of humor, and I feel like I would laugh for no reason around you. I, yeah, I definitely got a... If, if I don't know you, I definitely have a dry sense of humor. For sure, for sure. You, you, it's probably people that have met me that been like, mm -mm, I don't want to be around her. I'm glad you got that vibe. Because I got it first. You know what I'm saying? And sometimes I won't be like, yeah, uh, I'm going I'm to a, I'm a cut you off and not tell you I cut you off type of person. That's That's definitely me but i already i already felt the vibe you know what i'm saying I, I i felt the vibe and i ain't fucking with it you know what i'm saying so you're gonna get cut off i don't have to tell you because i know you know i know you know i know you know i felt the vibe and i know you felt uh, one yeah. too <laughs> nothing to do with me but it's just like i'm telling bro, you i don't like stuff like that because you could have just really mm -hmm. said in my face and told me what it was and just because what i got work. to tell you all right y'all so Hey, we down to our last question, and y'all feel me? This situation ain't something that I feel like we should just sit down and just talk hella much on, because y'all know what happened. It's all over social media, but I want to end it off on a good note. So I okay. said... So y'all gonna kiss? Do you believe right now, like, just from us hanging around each other today and stuff like that, like, do you believe that we can have something genuine? Like, 100%. Like, no bullshit just involved. Like... Of course. And then on that, like, the people that wasn't doing me no good in life... I cut them off, so it's like I, I really had a feeling that was neat. By the way, she was to myself now, <laughs> and you know, if you want to come to North Carolina, you can. I don't live with nobody. I'm not doing that no more. I live by myself with my two dogs. Okay, and you could.
Oh. It'll be way different because all them people is not I gonna got somebody. I'm not trying to get into it with nobody. But <laughs> that was my next <laughs> thing. Like, were they talking? Like, did they like each other? That's the part I don't know. It's what nobody what else talking about. What's your last question? <laughs> like, damn. She said, <laughs> come on. How come you didn't bash me at all in the YouTube video like most people would have? But you already, like... It was nothing to bash you about, though. Like, it really was nothing for me to say. You just pissed me off. Like, I feel like for me to bash somebody, yeah, you got to you... really say some shit. Like, oh, I don't even want to say that on camera. You got to really say something to really piss me off for me to really take it there and get to talking about you. Like, I just feel like if I'm going to talk about you, I'm going to say that to your face. Like, that's just how I am. So, like, for me to get so angry to the point where I'm just really sitting here like, I ain't know you, nah. Like, I knew you, but I don't know you to be sitting here talking like I know you. You get what I'm saying? Like, you can't talk about somebody, like, heavy that you really, really don't know. So, it's like, yeah, I knew nah, I knew her from her situations, but... As far as her real life, real situations, like, we didn't get that far yet. Like, we didn't, like, it ain't, I didn't really know the Naima, like, everything that created Naima to be who she was today. Like, so it's like, I can't be like, oh, you went I don't even feel like you got to be a Leo to do that, though. I don't, I don't even feel like you got to be a Leo to cut somebody off and not tell them. I feel like that's a part of everybody's sign. But I feel like at some point, you got to know who you are. And what you allow in your space. I used to be like Ray and just allow anybody in my space. I used to be so accessible. You know what I'm saying? Very, very easily accessible. And now, you know, giving people access to you brings drama in your life. It brings drama in your life. You know what I'm saying? And that's the shit I don't want. You know, I don't want drama. I don't, I don't want none of that shit. You know what I'm saying? So less access, less stress. And I, I have to say, not being accessible to people, it's a different life. It's a total different life. I already love being at home. So, bitch, I'm here. Yeah, I'm at the crib. You know what I'm saying? I don't like people in my aura. I don't, I don't like people in my house. I don't like dapping people up sometimes, you know. I feel like energy transfers, so, girl, if I ain't feeling it, I'm just... This or this happened or I'm finna say something about that. It was not, like, it's nothing I could have talk shit about but the situation that happened. Literally, the situation. Other than that... Even, even when I went live, I didn't even say nothing about you. I just thought I was going to smack you. <laughs> like, it was really nothing for us to really Hell say. Hell yeah, now. definitely come with age, for sure. Definitely come with age because I was as green as as, uh, as they were, you know what I'm saying, when I was younger. But now, see, they learn the lesson, and they young, you know. But they going to learn it faster while they young because it's, they 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 get richer faster, you know what I'm saying. They, they're they way more responsible faster now. They have to be, you know what I'm saying. So they'll learn it faster. Negative about each other like Yeah, I that. can't fake a vibe like, either. I ain't the one. I don't know. It was a situation that pissed me off and how she moved, y'all. That was really it. Other than that, I ain't nothing bad to say. Should I have? Here I go. Should I have? <laughs> I don't know. That's the thing. Well, maybe that's because that's just something that I'm used to. Like, the people that I'm cool with and then I fall out with. They just... See, I feel like they probably knew more, too, though, because, like, we hung, but we that was our first time hanging. So I really, like, was never really around to see shit or be like, oh, I could get on Oh, Eureka. Knees. This was your bracelet first. I took it. Oh, you ain't shit. <clears throat> Sir, she's making you one right now. No, it's already made. Oh, it's already made. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That was my first time being around you. That's real. Two. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. So listen, 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 listen. Y'all feel me? I don't know what y'all, like, really, really wanted out of this video. I hope we cover everything y'all always wanted to ask, you know, from this situation. I wasn't going to go. It ain't really, really much to go really, really deep about because, I mean, that's really, I feel like we touched base on everything that happened. The live, the fighting, the apology. <laughs> Should we edit this again here? I'll put it up there though, y'all. I'm gonna send y'all. I'm gonna. I can post what not send me when like we got back cordial. Like I'm gonna post what. And that's the thing. Like we weren't even following each other on Instagram. We was just on Twitter. Cordial, like, and I, I didn't even. People didn't even know though. Like I didn't feel like I didn't need to 
This why I know I fuck with you though. Anybody that would have got an apology from somebody, they would have tried to steal till that day made it been like, y'all see, I wasn't wrong about when I see me that. I didn't feel the need to go public about it. I didn't feel the need to tell nobody. I said, when they asked me in the Q&A, they said, is you and Naima cool? I even told you, I said, we actually had just talked and, you know, we had had stuff out. But I wasn't finna go on social media like, look, y'all, Naima sent this message. She apologized. She was wrong. I wasn't doing none of that because at the end of the day, I felt like what we had still was genuine. Like, regardless, not is a piece of work, though. I do believe That's that she a is fact. a piece of work. So it take really take a special person to really fuck with her and be cool That's with her a because fact. she a high head to me. Like, That's a fact. You are. She you a was. lot. I don't know how you be now. She could be chilling. I don't know. But, y'all, I hope we answer all the questions y'all been wanting to know. If y'all like this video, you want to truth or drink. Get this video to... T- the older I get, I ain't reading them long-ass text messages. 20K likes, you feel me? This is my 400K special. I'm dropping bangers all week. So, I hope y'all ready for these bangers. I hope you're ready for the truth I drink. Because, oh, boy, oh, oh boy. My God. <laughs> you ready? You going to end it off? It's your girl, Naima. Thank y'all for watching this video. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe and we'll be back with another video peace that was oh that was good that was really good all right yeah bye